Now let's see this problem. Design DFA for number of A's which are divisible by 3 over the alphabet A comma B or number of A's will always be tripled. So here sigma is A comma B. Now let us write the language. We know that language means a collection of strings. So here what is the constraint? Number of A's are divisible by 3. So we know that 3 is divisible by 3. Why? Because if you perform division operation with 3, we will get 3 only. So likewise, uh, 6 will also, 6 is also divided by 3. Next 9 is divisible by 3. 12 is divisible by 3 likewise. So here, the number of A's must be divisible by 3. So it may be either 3 number of A's or 6 A's or 9 A's likewise. What about number of B's? Uh, there is no constraint on number of B's. So we can take 0 number of B's or 1 B's or 2 B's likewise. So here the minimum string is triple A. So A's are 3. Next string, uh, let us take one more string. So number of A's are 3, number of B's are 2. Let us take one more string. 6 A's, let us take 6 A's. So likewise we can have number of, likewise we can have infinite number of strings. So number of A's are 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let us take one more uh, A. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 A. So number of A's are 6. 6, okay. Uh, now let us see the DFA. Uh, first we have to find the number of states. In order to find the number of states, uh, we have to consider the minimum string. So here the minimum string is triple A. The length of this triple A is 3. So number of states which are required are 3 plus 1. That is 4 states. So the initial state is Q0. So the remaining states are Q1, Q2, Q3. So Q3 is the final state. Whereas Q0 is the initial state. So how many A's we have to apply? 3 A's. Why? Because number of A's are divisible by 3. So if we apply 3 A's, then we will get the final state. Uh, now let's see whether it is uh, DFA or not. It is not DFA. Uh, so on Q0, we have to apply the B's. So here, uh, before this triple A, we can have any number of B's. So simply we can apply self loop B here. After 1A also, now on Q1, we have to apply the B. After 1A also, we can have any number of B's. Here, those A's may be contiguous or may be at different locations. That is not given here. The only constraint which is given is number of A's are divisible by 3. Okay. So, here between A and A, we can have any number of B's. So, likewise, here also we can have any number of B's. So, likewise, here also we can have any number of B's. So, 1A, 2A's, 3A's. Next, uh, it should also accept 6As also, 6As also. So for that purpose, we have to make an extra connection. So for that purpose, what we have to do is, if we apply A on Q3, then go to the transition A. So let me have 6As. So first A, second A, third A, this is fourth A, fifth A, sixth A. So this is nothing but our final state. So like this, we can construct the DFA. If you see here, what is the second question here? A's will always be tripled. So A's are always tripled. Like we can have 3 A's, 6 A's, 9 A's. So these two are same only. Okay. So if we, if we take this thing and check uh, whether DFA is correct or not. So Q0 on A means Q1. Q1 on B, Q1. Q1 on A, Q2. Q2 on B, Q2, Q2 on A, Q3, next, Q3 on B, Q3, next, Q3 on A, Q1, Q1 on B, Q1, Q1 on A, Q2, so Q2 on A, Q3. So let me have 9 A's. So first A, second A, third A, 
नेक्स्ट फोर्थ ए फिफ्थ ए सिक्सथ ए सेवेंथ ए एथ ए नाइन्थ ए सो दिस इज अवर डी एफ ए आर वी कैन आलो रईट एन अदर डायग्राम इन स्टेड ऑफ यूजिंग फोर स्टेट्स वी कैन यूज ओनली थ्री स्टेट्स सो क्यू नाट अल्लाई ए वी विल गेट क्यू वन अल्लाई ए वी विल गेट क्यू टू सो इफ यू अल्लाई ए आन क्यू टू देन गो टू द स्टेट क्यू नाट लेट इट बी द फाइनल स्टेट let it be the final state so one year second year so this is nothing but third year so this is our final state let we have three more years so fourth year fifth year sixth year okay so this diagram is also correct so now we can have any number of bees so here also we can have any number of bees here also we can have any number of bees okay so here we know that zero is also divisible by 3 zero is also divisible by 3 so what is zero modulo 3 So zero modulo three means three zero sa zero zero minus zero means zero. So we got zero as the result. So zero is also divisible by three. So that means epsilon is also a valid string. So epsilon means we have zero number of years. Epsilon means we have zero number of years. In that occasion, we have to make q not as the final state. We have to make q not as the final state. So if the language contains, if we include epsilon also. Then please make Q not as the final state. Suppose if the language doesn't contain epsilon, then there is no need to make Q not as the final state. Okay. Whereas for this, here Q not is the final state, so this DFA can also accept this epsilon also. So in this way we can uh, solve the.